So this is my trike. It's a color reed trike. Made in America, because that's the way I roll. In Boca Raton. Um, used to be part of a different bike company. And I'm going to go out and it's just gorgeous out. I see that sun, so clouds are moving in as usual. I'm going to go out in about 35, 45 minutes and uh, take me a nice ride. Today is Sunday, April the 7th, going out for a ride. And, you know, I got on this blue golf shirt and I could go out and, you know, got a nice short haircut looking good. And uh, I could go out in this blue shirt and not really be seen. Or, or I could be dressed in a bright red shirt with a blue collar around it. And... That's kind of the whole idea is to stay alive by getting the people to give you a couple of seconds extra. They see you, they then start to do whatever they're going to do, but at least they see you and you don't blend into the land. The idea of silly guy serious cycling is to be seen. And if I have to look silly, I mean, there's your two American flags properly posted. And on today's ride, um, as I mentioned, I'm going into multi-camera stuff. And I've got two cameras already mounted there. Today is Sunday, August uh, the 7th. I'm going out, and I mentioned that this year I was going to do multi-camera rides. So using duct tape, I've mounted two flip videos there. And I'm going to carry um, one hand camera with me to try to get the front view. But, uh, you know, right now I've got on a bright red shirt. Gorgeous out. Just gorgeous. And, uh... You know, hopefully nobody will hit me because it's in my red shirt and my American flags. Maybe somebody will see me. So what you're hearing now is the wind. What I'm hearing is the Grateful Dead in the headphones. But uh, I got flags on this bike, duct tape, bright red shirt, just trying to be seen. This is a seven speed made in Boca Raton, Florida. And uh, whoever did it didn't really ride it much because they put the handbrakes in a strange position. But uh, man, life is a strange position. Nothing that way. And again, it's probably windy, but I got the Grateful Dead on. And I got to figure out how to use these mirrors. There we go. In the one mirror, maybe this shot will show the flag. Silly the guy. Definitely serious cycling. Definitely silly guy. cool to see. I saw that person at the last minute. Uh, already I can tell this uses different muscles than uh, riding my two-wheeler. And I'm sure you can hear that wind, so this is like sailing against the wind. Camera show. Time is clear. So on this primary camera, between the wind and my voice, I think you'll hear something. But I did not know what it sounds like with the back cameras until I review those edits. No hands on this is not safe.
find the lowest gear. And then the background, which I'm going to start to dub in. I've got some Grateful Dead going on. But what happens is, with the YouTube channels I have, uh, Google sends me these notices, third content, third party uh, content violation. But now, I have to uh, put music or narration behind those videos that doesn't belong to some rock artist. So, I'm practicing and learning how to sing bluegrass gospel without a band. And that starts by taking lyrics off the internet. And uh, about my look, I have on uh, some good wind shades. I got two other choices. And uh, I want to look less silly this year as I ride. I'm trying to show some human improvement. So I'll probably switch glasses. Now, shade I set of shades I have on here, I call my Bobby shades because I look like somebody named Bubba. But they're actually, if you can look, they come real low on the eye. They curve nice on the side. And these will do for 65% uh, of the days. Uh, first pair of hat on is really cool. Can wear them 75% of the time. But if I'm cycling on dirt, like the Lehigh Canal, or if I'm out in the woods, and there's a lot of mosquitoes, um, I switch to my full off Home Depot safety goggles, which I got back there. And uh, I noticed that my my ride on my trike last year got a lot of views. Uh, I tell you, this is a workout that they will call spinning. If I was a person who worked out indoors, <laughs> people are going off to a wedding now. Thing, let's see how that looks. A lot of reliance on your back on this bike, and that kind of worries me. Um, as I'm trying to ride, to take the pressure off my back, strengthen my feet. I have on these uh, size 15 with the Velcro, and that allows you to alter, uh, the, the, you know, the action on the shoe but they're not what I work in.